I'm having so much fun with this. <laughs> Too much fun to be exact. Okay. How to get out of here and not die? Run for my freaking life. Run for my life, run for my life, run for my life, run for my life. Holy shit. And they're coming 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 and they're coming. And they're coming. And they're coming 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 don't come no more. Hey, they're not coming no more. Yay! Probably gonna get invaded, but yay! Whew. Okay. Now that I'm done with this, time to check because like you can go to level 50 now. So, and with my souls, I'm gonna totally do that. So, I'm gonna be right back. Check the stats again. Because I can't remember. What is a man? Okay, and I'm back. So, the stats are probably... This is what the stats are going to be. Listening them to the right, as usual. And so, we're going to go for 15 Vitality. Um, two more into Endurance. So, you know, 15 Vitality, 20 Endurance. Sounds good. Um... Then I'm going to use some soul items because I got a lot, a lot of them. And then level up to dexterity 28. Oh no. And it happened. You know what that means. You know what that means. As soon as I hit 43. And this is why I suggest always playing offline. What? I'm a sucker for punishment. So yeah, suggest playing offline if you're ever playing this build because you can get invaded. Who am I going to get invaded by? This is going to be interesting. And if he invaded me already, Jesus Christ. Waiting. I kinda wanna do my souls, bro. Oh, there we go. Guess he couldn't invade me. <laughs> yeah, okay. Dexterity. Then you wanna, um. Choose more of these. Do some more of these. And then use a whole bunch of these. Yeah. Aw, yeah. Love when I get some silvers, man. So I'm going to level up my dexterity again. So I'm at 27. So, yeah. Okay, so um, another thing to talk about the build is that why, some people say, why would you do dexterity instead of faith? Um, I was going to talk about it because I'm getting invaded now. What the f- ah, I should go offline, I should go offline. Ah. Okay. Well, anyway, while I'm waiting for this douchebag to come in and invade me, see a Belmont be scared. Okay, um... This is what I missed, what I was talking about. The, uh, stats. Um, why I do dexterity first is just because you can upgrade your whip faster, you can get it stronger, and Robo Robler 1 has invented. Ugh. Can't even say his name right. Robler 1, let's see. Let's see him kick our ass real quick. No, 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 no. Gonna get invaded, gonna get invaded, gonna get invaded. Going up the stairs, looking for the dude. Where did he go, go, go? I'm just gonna go up there and find him. Because 
I'm trying to get this ball rolling, man. I ain't trying to fight no people. I'm trying to save the freaking Dark Soul universe, man. It's bomb fight. Oh. I ain't that scared. Shit. Let's see how this goes, bro. What are we doing? <laughs> We're just having fun. This guy's pretty cool. That was interesting. <laughs> interesting. He joined my game and he just wanted to do some gestures. That guy's cool. Robber one, you're cool. <laughs> Watch he comes back and kills me. I swear to God. Okay, back to what's saying. Okay, um, upgrading the dexterity. Um. Yeah, I wanted to upgrade the dexterity because you can upgrade your whips normally faster than if you get to get the divine because you you can't even upgrade the whip, the divine whip to plus 10 until you get to the catacomb. So to go for divine at first is pretty, it's just, it makes it too difficult, like stupid hard. Like it doesn't, they're no fun at all. It's just annoying. So what I suggest is just to go for dexterity and then upgrade your faith while you're doing the dexterity because at, at there's a point where your dexterity stops and you'll go for faith more and that's when you upgrade your um your whip to a vampire killer so that's what i suggest so right now um i'm gonna since i have this and i have that um i have a good amount of, let me see how many tiny night shards do i have the thorn whip is actually not upgraded at all so that kind of sucks, but that's how it is. Um, what I think I'm gonna actually do is that I'm gonna actually um, upgrade the whip at uh, no, I'm gonna actually um, yeah, I'm gonna actually upgrade my whip later after um. I get past everything and open the big doors in Dracula's castle around Orlando. Um, and yeah, I, I just want to do it. Then I'm going to go upgrade it. Use the, and then upgrade the thorn with because supposedly it does get an amount of damage. I don't know, but from what I hear. So we'll go check that out. Right now, we're going to go through Dracula's castle, the beginning part of it. Try to get to the doors. So. We'll see. Let's do it. Oh shit! I knew it! I knew it! I told you. I don't even know what I'm doing. Shit! What oh. am I doing? <laughs> Just use use the ABB. Hey.